What's going on, guys? It's Ben. Uh, we're back with a little vlog today. Spending today with the little one. Can you say hi? <laughs> She's shy. She's eating some apple slices while we get breakfast ready. So, for breakfast, we're doing some banana pancakes. Uh, it's one of the classic things I like to do for her. She likes <laughs> eggs, but she doesn't always like eating plain eggs, so it's a nice substitute. I can work it in there. Throw a little chocolate chips in there, too, sweeten it up a little bit. Oh, yeah. For a batter here, it's just bananas, eggs, baking soda, flour, vanilla, and a little bit of brown sugar. Here's a little pancakes. Got some mini ones going for Harper right now. No! What are you doing? Are you a silly butt? Are you a silly butt? Is Puffy trying to steal your apples? No. None of that now. <laughs> Give her a pancake. Just a little flip. And those are going to go for one to two more minutes on the other side until they get nice and browned up and then we'll pull them off of there. So for breakfast I'm just doing these banana pancakes, some apple slices, and I was going to fry up some ham to do with it. I just feel like there's too much protein in one breakfast so we're probably going to save our, the ham for lunch. This weather recently has been crazy. We'll have one week where it's 85, maybe 90 degrees and then like right now it's like 40 degrees out and it's gonna be that the whole damn day. It's just been absurd. <laughs> Check this out though. There's a little birdhouse over there, if you can see. Little bird nest. It's a house finch. That's, that's the female. She's got the red breast and the red head and everything. The male is like super gray and silver. They're pretty cool looking birds, but I noticed they put their nest up there a couple weeks ago and I've just been kind of keeping an eye on them. It's pretty cool. Grab a little plate. Normally I go for more like of a circular pancake, but they're for the little one. She's about to rip and tear them up anyway, so not too concerned about it at the moment. What's wrong, beautiful? You hungry? You ready for breakfast? Yeah, daddy's got your pancakes done. We'll get your plate made. I'll let you start eating while I'm getting this breakfast finished up. Yeah, you like that idea, huh? I'm also going to do one more little one just in case she decides she wants another one. Whether it be now or later. These are nice though because I can for real just pop them in the freezer if there's any extra after breakfast and then I can just put them right in the microwave when she wants them or I can eat them as a quick breakfast before I go to work in the mornings. Because I typically will leave for work at like 6 in the morning so I don't have a lot of time to you know, be making breakfast or anything beforehand. I normally do like some oatmeal, get some protein bars, something like that. But uh, sometimes that's just not always cutting it. Sometimes it's nice to have an actual like made breakfast. So we just got the last of our pancakes done. We'll just fall in this real quick. So we don't really have any plans for today besides just eating some good food and maybe going to find something to do if the weather holds out for us. It looks like it's going to be pretty chilly but the sun seems like it's out which is a plus because it's been pretty rainy the past couple days. Yeah it looks pretty nice and sunny out. Anywho. We're gonna finish up breakfast. Honestly, I'm kind of worried whether she'll like them. I used dark chocolate chips and I uh, didn't even think about that until now. Hope that didn't ruin everything. <laughs> that drizzle. Hey. Hey, Harper, is that good? Oh, yeah. 
breakfast action. Hanging out, watching some SpongeBob. Puppies chilling. I mean, you can't go wrong with, like, basically a banana bread with chocolate chips in it. I mean. So I finished up breakfast. You already know we start the day with a cup of coffee. Got to. We got our coffee going on. We got our creamer. Sweet cream is the way to go. I was using caramel macchiato for a little while, but I kind of burnt myself out on that. So I've been going with the sweet cream again. It was like a Cold Stone Creamery collab for a while, but then they dropped Cold Stone or Cold Stone dropped them. I don't know. What's funny is we actually sell cheese uh, to the Cold Stone Creamery that we make up at Firefly Farms. I think it's funny in that like uh, ice cream creamery place buys cheese from the other creamery and that they don't just make their own. I don't know. Something about that's kind of funny to me. First sip of coffee of the day. Always goes hard. Hey. So we finished up breakfast, got all cleaned up from that, and she's getting pretty sleepy, so we're gonna get her a bottle and put her down for a little nap before we go do anything else. We gotta make sure the little one's taken care of. Also, I don't buy this milk to be fancy. We're lactose intolerant, so. <laughs> She's like, get that damn camera out of my face, Dad. <laughs> Alright, so Harper and I just got back from lunch with our grandma. Uh, that was fun. I ended up getting the turkey Reuben, and she had some fries, some of my Reuben, and then some of a burger, and she loves ranch, so she always has ranch with her fries. But the weather has been pretty nice out today, so me and her are going to take a walk. Probably go down by the river and go see the ducks and everything. Uh, it feels good out. It's like 59, 60 degrees out right now. Not too cold, not too windy. Beautiful day. And she's going home with her mama today, so we're going to go do some fun stuff before she leaves. You want me to open it? You want to push it? All right, I got it. Can you give me your hand. Ready? A big step. Woo! Good job. You getting the keys out? Good job. Thank you. Get some lights on. What's up, Pop? How you doing, buddy? the street. What are you doing, silly girl? <laughs> Who are you waving at? You're silly. There's a couple of people behind us, so there's like some background volume. Probably tone the sound down. Just a beautiful little spot down through here, this river. Some geese down to our uh, left here. We're probably gonna walk down that way and see what's up. She seems to be liking it though. But I gotta pay close attention to her because the water. Are those three ducks? Followed us all the way from down where that wall is. <laughs> they finally stopped walking towards us and they're just chilling by the river. But just being cautious, trying to stay a safe distance. Harper is like fighting me though. She wants to see the ducks because she likes ducks. She likes animals in general. She's such a sweet kid and she's an animal lover. Are those ducks? <laughs> Can you say duckies? Yeah. Can you say ducks? Yeah. <laughs> 
what's going on. It was like the medical emergency car. Weird. So there was a goose that ended up kind of like, I don't know, it seemed like it was charging us. It had its head down and it was just running at us. So we bounced out of there and now we're just walking around. So we're back home now. We got a new book in the mail today. Uh, just a program we do. Uh, so we're probably going to open it up and read it, check it out. This is Blow Here. I mean, it's a dandy line, so that's kind of cool. But... Uh, we had fun today. Uh, you know, breakfast, and then a nice nap, at lunch with our grandma, and we got to go have a fun walk and see some ducks and geese, some angry-ass geese, before we left. We'll probably have a little snack and read our book before her mom picks her up, and then I'm not sure what I'm going to get into after that. Keeping it healthy with the apple slices. You like your apples? Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a good thing we didn't start recording until we did, because I uh, just passed the cop. He was going the opposite direction, of course, but always sketchy. I just dropped my daughter off. No, no baby in the car. Wouldn't be recording and driving uh, or on my phone at all if there was a baby in the car. Just saw a fly in here though. That's kind of bothersome. I don't know about y'all, but bugs like really, really bother me. <laughs> uh, anyway, we're gonna go try to link up with a friend, see if he wants to hang out, and then probably chill and maybe smoke something. I also got a ton of like cheese and stuff from work, so we might do a little charcuterie board. I don't know. Depends if we want to like stop and get something to drink or not. I might grab like a couple beers or something just to kick back with a friend. But yeah, I'll get back with y'all when we figure something out. We have to stop and get gas for this thirsty girl. Fill her up. You get like some kind of phone stand so I can just pop my phone up and chill like that. It's just very impractical to hold my phone while I'm driving and also kind of irresponsible. Don't do that. <laughs> Like I said, stopped, got gas. It's a quick 50 out the wallet. Gotta love that. Gas is so expensive anymore, man. Everything is. Inflation's just insane. Like, I went grocery shopping probably a couple days ago and spent like 150 And that's only gonna last me like a week or two. And I'm buying like Whole Foods as well. I'm not buying like a bunch of stuff that you just throw in the freezer and it's just snacks and junk food. It's a lot of like fruit and vegetables meats, uh, you know, like rice, pasta, stuff I can make sauces or dinners out of, a lot of stuff, like meal food, you know, but I don't know, it's just insanely expensive anymore. I remember it was like a dollar and a quarter for milk in Maryland, and uh, like two, three years ago, and now I was talking to my buddy who lives in Maryland, he said it's like, uh, like high two dollars, almost three dollars, maybe three and a quarter. In West Virginia, for a gallon of milk, it's three fifty nine or something. And that's not even like crazy priced compared to a lot of places, but like with the minimum wage being as low as it is here, that's that is pretty pricey. But I know I've seen some people out in like California where their milk is like nine dollars a gallon for uh, that's like organic milk and stuff. I don't I don't know what regular milk is priced out there. Honestly, I can imagine it's probably like six seven dollars a gallon though, because it gets pricey out there on the West Coast. My backup camera has been giving me so much trouble here recently. I need to take it into the shop and see what's up with that. I got a warranty and everything, so if it is a problem or electronical issues, they can all fix that under warranty. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. The other day it was displaying upside down. But, like, I'll go out of reverse and then go back into reverse. Sometimes it'll fix it. No, it's just fucked right now. It started doing this when we went to the beach, um, summer of 2022. There were some days where uh, it would just be all black, and it was weird. It was always when like I parked it out in the sun. If I parked it in the shade, it was fine. But at the place we was at, there was only like two, three spots where we could park in the shade, like under a carport. I also have to go to the store later, so so that's something I'll have to do here before too long. But it's nothing too important I need for now. I uh, just need like dog food and some other stuff like that. And I at least have food in his bowl for now. So that's the important part. Uh, honestly, I'm probably about to go take a couple of dabs and see if my friend wants 
to get in anything like I was talking about. So currently, and then my grandma's friend's house, my friend was busy, he is out of town at the moment, so not hanging out today. But <laughs> my grandmother's friend, uh, she's not very computer smart when it comes to like anything except getting on Google and Facebook. So she got a virus or something, uh, got her computer fixed, and now she doesn't even know how to set up the cords to plug it back in, so I had to come save the day. Realized I completely forgot to film an outro for that. Uh, I was up at my grandma's till like 11 or something last night, just helping her and her friend out with shit, and then we were just drinking a few beers and reminiscing on times uh, we had like growing up at camp and stuff. Haven't done that in a few years, so that was pretty fun. But anyway, Already had my cup of coffee and stuff for the day, got showered up, so I'm about to head out and run a few errands, but just wanted to record this outro before I do anything. Thank you all for checking the video out. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. If you made it this far, let me know if you'd like to see more stuff like this, and it's been Ben. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.